Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in return with having. We, of course, are wanting to earn the most amount of income or revenue for our business that we can. Whether we're running a small business or a micro business or whether we're an independent business sales professional who has to make a living off commission or whether we're something who's actually an employee of an organization, this is how we, well, get our taxes paid for, right? In life, we have moments of time to speak the truth and the truth is we all have to work. We all have to learn to serve and we all have to be able to provide a quality consumer goods or services, meaning we have to know how to deliver customer service. If you don't know how to deliver customer service for your industry, well, there's plenty of benchmarking information out there that can help you to learn that. In other words, what are the best practices for your industry? Look it up. Best practices for my industry of mortgage. Best practices for the industry of real estate. Best practices for the industry of, I don't know, Japanese language instruction. Whatever. But in your lifetime, you have to decide what those best practices are once you've discovered them, once you've researched them, once you've done them, you have to figure out what can I really do that makes me feel, well, on par in my industry. You see, the people who consume your industry are accustomed to experiencing you and your competition. And if your competition's best practices or standard operating procedures are better than the ones that you're delivering, most likely they're going to go to the competition. You see, it's not just a willy-nilly, I'll do whatever I feel like world. It's a people have an expectation of what your industry should be delivering. And if you personally don't perform your job the way that people are anticipating you to do so or have experienced the way that you should in your industry and in your particular profession, they're probably going to walk out the door and go elsewhere.